Hey, what up guys, Two Nako here. Today we have Destiny Nightfall again, and this week with Tanix. Woohoo! Let's look at the buffs, debuffs we got. Yeah, oh boy. Specialists in Orgburn. Really? The patience and time will annihilate everything. Gee. We'll do this quick, wet, and sloppy. Trust me. Before we start, let's talk about some weird Destiny merchandise I've found lately. I googled a bit and there's the standard shit, you know, like t-shirts, keychains, mugs, wallets and stuff. But I stumbled upon some really, really weird items, like these hunter cloaks. I mean, I can understand if you want to use it for a cosplay or something, but not in everyday life. Imagine wearing this when you go to school or work, or when you go to the grocery store. And look at this branding iron attached to a lighter. What the fuck? What I'm supposed to brand mark with this? My girlfriend? You're mine, honey. No, sit down and hold tight. <laughs> Another thing is this Destiny Ghost Soap. Wow, I found it on Reddit and I was like, shit. It's not an official item though. But speaking of soap, there's an official Microsoft Xbox controller soap you can actually buy in the official store. And the official item description says, this item gives gamers a reason to shower. <laughs> wow, this is just literally saying, Quote Halbent, you guys fucking stink, here's some soap, now pre-order Halo you disgusting fucks. <laughs> Microsoft, the best fucking merchandise in the world. Now back to the nightfall. Um, I'm not sure if Bungie's doing this on purpose or not, but I have the feeling that the nightfalls are getting easier each week. I can't believe it. I mean specialists in Arkburn on fallen enemies? Wow, that's sure a one shot for a fallen major. No fucking challenge at all. Well, whatever. Let's go for it! Okay, jumping into the strike, we run straight to the first encounter with Tanix. Don't waste your time killing the Shriekers or the Hive Crab. As you confront him, he, he will try to trick you. Fight! Win! <laughs> Lift field distortion. Catch just above you. First encounter, just stay at the door. That's our safe spot. Take care of the snipers first, then kill the shit that teleports in. And as soon as Tanix spawns, try to stagger him with your sniper rifle. Um, I kind of fucked it up here in this video, but whatever. We have specialists in Arkbird, who fucking cares? Five hits with the patience, and he'll teleport back up to the ship.
You are challenged in the ways of old. Tanix is jamming our comms. Fight well, Guardian. Next area, go down the stairs into the room and trigger the enemies. Now run back and jump on this platform right here. That's our safe spot. Um, three hits on Tanix and he will move on to the next area. Take care of Tanix first, then kill the rest of the room. Um, be careful if you jump off the platform because we have light switch. Don't let him touch you. The melee attacks from the enemies are beyond deadly. Walker room, you go in, kill the first couple of Drax, then turn left and shoot the Fallen Major and the two snipers in the tunnel. Don't kill, I repeat, don't fucking kill the snipers in the far left corner of the room yet. Now, prepare to jump on the balcony next to the snipers. Titans or Warlocks jump straight up. Hunters need to go in miss first and use the crate to reach the balcony. On top you'll find a door. You open the door with your ghost. So keep in mind each time you want to get back in through the door. You have to get out your ghost first. Keep that in mind. Um, now kill the snipers to trigger the walker. Just use your whatever rocket launcher. Whatever you have. Just kill one of these snipers. And the, the, the walker will drop down. Shoot the little turret on the walker first. 
This turret can fuck you up pretty bad. So we have an orc burn. It can almost one shot you. So kill off the little turret first. Um, watch out for the for the sni for the little snipers. They're not little. They're just fucking normal snipers. So watch out for the snipers which pop on the opposite side, and that's it. Pretty much for this room. It's really easy. Just look at the video. It's a fucking cake. Okay, now for Tanix. So damn easy with these buffs this week. So damn fucking easy. You go in, go left, and smoke it with your patience and time. And that's it. I mean, I missed a couple of shots in this video, and I still had plenty of time to kill him. It's so damn easy. Well, that's it for today, guys. And one thing, while I was editing this video, we got our 100th subscriber. I can't even talk. I'm so stunned. I can't even fucking talk. We got our 100th subscriber. Oh my god. I never, ever thought we'd get 100. Seriously, guys, you are fucking amazing. Oh my gosh. Um, we're gonna have a special Q&A vid, as I promised, I promised it, so we're gonna have a special Q&A video, so stay tuned, I really can't believe it. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, and as always, like if you like, dislike if you don't like this shit, and feel free to subscribe to our channel for more awesome Destiny and Gaming stuff, see you next time.